Okay, today I have this cute koala. Look, it's a really cute design. Um, and it had even the eucalyptus here. So uh, let's do it. So you're gonna need, I think, you know, the basics are gonna be two, 260 gray and one uh, white and then a scrap of black. So a scrap balloon of black 260. Okay, so let's start with the 260 gray. And you're gonna start making this, look. Um, like, what, how many finger cell? Like eight finger tail. And then you make like a three finger bubble. And then here, a pinch twist, like a three finger pinch twist. So one, and then make another one. Two, three finger pinch twist. Then here, like three finger bubble, again. Three finger bubble, but pinch twist, this finger bubble, another one, pinch twist. Then you're going down. So this is like a triangle head. You go with a three finger and connect it together. When you have that, you're gonna do this again, like this. You're gonna pass, you know, and go back, and then go back, go back. Let's see. So. How it goes this design so now this bubble look goes one to the other side but this one here on top i like to make it one on top of the other one just like this and then the other one goes all the way in the back okay now you're going down this way and it's like a four finger bubble or even less let's see yeah four finger bubble and then here you're gonna make two pinch twists two big pinch twists so if it's getting too tight um yes it's okay two finger pinch twists like this so the these pinch twists are like four finger bubble pinch twists so now with this i'm gonna take the air out and just leaving the four finger bubble and then make it into a pinch twist. Okay. When you have that, now you use your second balloon to 60 gray. And you connect it right there. And so you have this part, like, and now you need to make another one that is gonna be the tail. So it's a pinch twist, but you probably know, like, four finger bubble, it's gonna be like a two finger bubble pinch twist, smaller. And then also a little one. So this is the same design I'm doing for the bunny that I just uh, post a tutorial. And I think I like, you know, that technique. Um, so this is the thing. We have another uh, small pinch twist in the front part. And look, this is the trick. This bubble is like a four finger bubble. So this one is going to be a little bit bigger because it's going to be kind of the belly, right? So a little bit, maybe one five finger bubble. You see, just a little bit bigger. And then from here, you just accommodate things. And the idea is that the bigger, uh, the biggest uh, pinch twist that you make, you have to put it right here in between. You see? Right there. And, and then the little pinch twist goes right on the bottom. And then this tail goes in the back side. That's gonna be the tail, the medium pinch twist. Okay, now what else here? You um, just gonna leave this balloon for a moment. Um, or actually, what we can start doing is the the arms. So look, what I did is just squish the balloon, make it soft. This one, and just go around like this. Look, go around, trying to you know make the shape. Then here twist. And then squish, you know, keep squishing the balloon and then go up to the other side, but very soft. See? Because that way, you know, it's gonna be easier to make them stay holding the belly. Okay, now with the rest, you just keep it in the back side. And it's time to attach what is, um, look, this is how it's looking so far. So, this is these bubbles that are the arms just keep it soft you see so then you can you know 
make a fold a bit like that. Okay, now this piece of loom wait here, and now use your scrap, and you just have to make a like three finger bubble, something like this. How many? Yeah, three finger bubble. Okay, you cut and leave some space there, because then you're gonna use it to attach. Oh, but the rest of the black, then you're gonna need two little bubbles, so um, I you shouldn't not lose the end. Oh. Let's see, just a little bit. Then you just make a little one finger bubble and make it into a pinch twist. And you just leave some here space to attach it because it's gonna be attaching to uh, the ears. Okay, now the second is one finger bubble and tie it as a pinch twist. Okay, when you have that, then you don't need more of the black uh, balloon. Cut it, leaving some space like this. Okay, so um, now let's go with the ear. So, oh wait, oh wait, this, the nose. So uh, this is what I did. I grabbed this little piece, you know, and pass it through the other side. And then here, this thing, this part, you just measure probably like mm, three finger bubble this part, three finger bubble, and then you connect it. So you tie it with that part and tie it. Don't uh, break this because that's gonna be the last part for the feet. So save it, leave somewhere out because you're gonna need to make the feet, the legs, okay? So save this part. Okay, and just make sure I'm, I'm tidying this. And now, look, this can be hiding there, and this nose just goes all the way and connected to the neck. Mm -hmm. Okay, so when you have that, you look. Now let's make uh, the what do you think? The eyes? Let's go with the eyes because you already made we already made this. So you just connect it right here, right there. Okay. Okay, grab one. And let's try the other one. Those are gonna be the eyes. Okay. So now what else we need? Uh, white. So let's grab your 160 white. And let's see, 160 white. Doesn't matter how much air you wanna leave there or you know inflate it. I think it's like eight finger tail. And you're just gonna use it to make these little details, like goes around the ears. Oops. Okay. And make sure it's all around the ear. And then you can go and put it right here so then you don't have to cut the balloon. I think that way it will, it's gonna be kind of uh, faster. But if you, uh, you don't want this bubble there, you just have to cut it and then attach it the other side. So, but you have to do the same the other ear. Okay. Mm -hmm. Make sure it's all around, so there's not much space in between. So then you cut the balloon, save it, because now we're gonna use it for the neck. That is a little bit of wider, and I think it's here. Okay. So put things whatever looks better mm -hmm. okay that's what i'm doing right now you see ah uh, okay what else we're doing here um doo -doo -doo -doo. uh the what is this Why for oh the neck <laughs> okay now let's go with a pinch twist look it's like two finger pinch twist okay now you can even tie it if you feel that it's gonna get a twist Okay, and now you stretch this, and this is gonna be around the neck, but this little pinch twist is gonna be right here, right behind the mouth, and, and I mean the nose, and that's gonna help us to kind of like make it into the idea of the mouth, because if you wanna put a smiley face there, that part is gonna help you to keep it. So you just go around, you cut the balloon, you don't need more of white, um, and then make sure it's all tight, yeah, so it doesn't come undone. Okay, now we cut the excess. 
And the thing is, in order to keep this bubble good, you know, you just bend in there. You keep it like this. Look. See? There. Okay. Now that it's like this, what else? This little piece. Let's do it and it's gonna be like this. Look, you just make a, like a pinch twist. Like this. Or you can make a little loop. So whatever works better for you. Okay? So it's gonna be like a big pinch twist and then a little pinch twist. Okay, that's gonna be one piece. And you have to do this the other side. But first you leave one finger bubble and then you go with another one finger bubble and then you go with a big, big pinch twist and then a small with the rest. And that's all you need. So you tie the balloon, make sure everything is there. And then you make sure this is one finger bubble each side and you just connect it with this little pinch twist here. So if you make that pinch twist soft, it's gonna be better. So because then it's gonna be easier to connect. Okay, and there we go. So you can make sure you see the... Okay, and that's kind of the idea of your koala bear. This part, the big pinch twist, I like it because it gives it more shape to the booty. You see, all the, oh, the high legs. <laughs> but I think it's a really cute design. What do you think? Now, to make it look more like a koala, people don't recognize, oh, is that, what is that? Okay, you can use Sharpie, but the most important one here, and it's not, look, I see it like it's a koala, but well, you can make a smiley face, you see, just like this, a little line, and something like this. See, so it's like the koala, cute koala mouth, I don't know. Okay, what else can make it look like a koala? Sharpie, and I like to use gray, I think it's gonna look good for the furry part. So you just pass it all, oh, strap it stops, all oh, strap it stops here. You know, even here to the arms, you know, some part. What else can, you know, you can do with your Sharpie? Oh, even around the eyes, you see? Around the eyes can help, you know, to um, make it look like a koala. It's, you know, very small details, like you cannot even much see. But the color gray oh, can give it some expressions too. Mm -hmm. You may hear some hair. Is it so what else? What else? What else we can add? Oh, they're black. Black just another thing is for, you see, the, the, the nails. So let's make one here, another one, and another one. Three in each side. I think those. You see, just lines. And then same here, three, very to the bottom, just like, just like this. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Look, how cute! Now, this is the very easy part because uh, for to make a hey, eucalyptus, you can just blow this scrap of brown 350. Like if you have a scrap, it would be awesome. If it's not, it can be 260, but the idea is you tie it, you know, and then little scrap of uh, green. So you just tie it, you see this part? And that's where I start tying the, uh, this little piece of balloon. I just tie it, look, tie one, then you go a little bit higher and tie this one. And this may be, you know, taking time, but if you have time and you say, oh yeah, I wanna make it more impressive, you can even put a little bit of one down here. So you can do that and it's gonna be, I think, more than enough. Look, just like that. And then you just put it through here. See? Just put it all the way through there and that's it. Look, how cute is this design? I hope you like it. Uh, it's kind of a long video, but it's just because of the little details that you don't need to do it in case you are in a hurry. Hmm. Okay, everybody. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for subscribing. And, and thank you, thank you for commenting. It uh, feels really good to see that uh, you're enjoying these videos. Okay, bye-bye.